Hi there. An unfortunate fact of life is that memory is not immune to aging, and that is the focus of today's video. What is the reason for our memory decline? Well, as we age, our central nervous system tends to slow. It's not that we lose the ability to retrieve information from our memory stores as such. It's just that it may take a little longer than it used to. But not all types of memory deteriorate at the same rate. That would be like expecting all types of people to tire at the same rate, or all competitors in a race to finish at the same time. It wouldn't really make sense. So let's look at the three types of memory. Sensory memory, short-term memory, and long-term memory, and how they typically decline across the lifespan. Let's start with sensory memory, which refers to visual, echoic, and physical information. Typically, we can attend to less sensory information as we develop into old age. That is, there seems to be a decrease in the efficiency of sensory memory in older age compared to adolescence and early adulthood. The rate of decline in short-term memory seems to depend a little on the type of task being attended to. The memory of simple tasks seem not to be affected as much as more complex ones. And indeed, verbal short-term memory tends to decline much more rapidly than visual short-term memory. And in long-term memory, procedural memories, that is, remembering how to do things, are scarcely affected by age. But on the other side of the coin, declarative memory does seem to be affected, in particular, episodic memory. Don't worry if some of those terms confuse you. We will look more in depth at sensory, short-term and long-term memory in subsequent videos. Try some of the questions below relating to memory decline over the lifespan. Thanks for watching and happy studying. Hey guys, click here to go to the Engage Wiki and then click here to watch the next video. Good night, I live here now.